Children everywhere are eagerly awaiting that Christmas morning visit from Santa Claus, but a few lucky kids already got to meet the jolly old elf earlier this week during a magical trip to the North Pole. Brandon Scott went along for the ride. Their holiday adventure began with one of the warmest welcomes ever received at LA International Airport. <laughs> 100 eager kids checked in at the Delta counter for a trip most children could only imagine. Are you ready to go to North Pole? See Santa? Many of these kids have battled serious illnesses like cancer and are getting treatment at LA's Children's Hospital. Ruby Spencer is seven years old and was diagnosed with leukemia just one week after her fifth birthday. She finished chemotherapy a few months ago. What do you think you're going to find at the North Pole? Santa. Are you excited? Yeah. Now the to the North Pole. Once on board the plane, the excited passengers buckled up for an unforgettable ride. He wants to see how to get to the North Pole, but I told him it's a surprise. So the windows have to stay closed? Stay closed. After about 30 minutes, they heard those magic words. The kids walked out to snow flurries and were greeted by cheering elves. They played hockey, met polar bears, and of course, saw Santa Claus. And while some were skeptical, Ruby believed in the magic. I saw the real Santa. This was the real Santa? Yes, it was. Well, what makes you think this is the real Santa Claus? This Santa, he has a real beard, so I know this is the real Santa. That made the jolly old elf himself even jollier. Yeah, it's great to just look at the kids and watch their eyes. You just look at them and they just love life. That's what makes them special. And even more special kids will have a special Christmas trip this year with other North Pole flights departing from New York, Atlanta, and Seattle. For CBS This Morning Saturday, Brandon Scott at the North Pole.